Hi guys, Nick Miller here today from Mark Supply Company. Today I have for you a um, Skyjack SJ6832. I have owned this lift myself personally since 2010, I believe I bought it. So I've had it about seven years. Um, we bought it initially to do a bunch of remod work here at our business. Um, we built a 44 by 8 storage building. We used it for all of that. Uh, basically inside to put ceiling up to finish out the building our main shop that we work out of every day we've used it in there for remodeling um, majority of the time it's set in our warehouse but here until the last year I did get moved outside um, local township borrowed it and that's probably part of the reason I'm selling it um, had it last winter and they plugged it in and they left it on hold on the charger and more or less burnt the charger and the batteries up so why it's gone. I'm not going to loan anything to anybody anymore. Kind of one of those deals. I just had enough of it. Um, I have since bought a smaller little weed lift that works for changing bulbs and stuff, so that's why this machine is for sale. I want to start you here at this lift. I'll take you completely around show you everything works, but again, this belongs to Mark and Nick Miller. I'm Mark Supply. This isn't something I bought to sell. It is something I bought to use. So, I just explained to you about the charger and the batteries. So, what I done last fall whenever it came back to me, it was no good the way it was. I bought a brand new charger, uh, 24 volt uh, electronics charger. Um, basically, just plug it in. It has a timer in it. It'll show a slow blink at 80, under 80 percent, fast blink over 80 percent, and then steady light whenever it is uh, complete. That was 500 bucks for a charger, uh, and there's 600 hours of the batteries. And I bought brand new Napa um, specialty golf cart deep cycle battery, which is what's in a man lift. Um, and they're all brand new as of last fall. Um, there again, everything works, it charges, does everything it's supposed to do without an issue. Okay, so go ahead and close that back up. This does have all foam filled tires. Tires are in good condition, a couple don't match up front. The steer tires, the rears do. Brakes work. This is an older lift, but it's not all welded or busted up. Um, coming around here to this side, here's a master cutoff over here, which it does work. This side here is your manual up and down. Hour meter you cannot read. It was that way whenever I bought it. Very simple lift. Very simple. Um, this little transformer switch and you know your basic uh, 24 volt uh, drive motor. Anybody could work on this thing. It's not overabundant of um, technical circuit boards and whatnot. This is a very very basic lift. So. Um, does have an expandable deck up top here. Come out, which I'll have a measurement for you um, in the listing. But everything there works. Again, not a brand new lift. Upstairs joystick, everything there works good. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead. I'll hop in it. I'll run it around. Show you everything works. Does have 110 in the basket uh, for running, you know, uh, cord or uh, corded equipment such as drills or saws. Um, that all works. With the flip, a simple flip of a key, you can see there the parking brake works. I'll go ahead and I'll go to uh, raise and lower. This is not a brand new lift by any means. But if you're doing some work in your shop like we've done, here is a very, very affordable man lift. Um, and again, it is a big platform lift, a 32 foot platform height. I believe it is 68 inches overall width. That's what a 68 32 should mean. Uh, there are no oil leaks. 
we have found everything works the way it's supposed to. It does go higher than this, but that's about as far as I want to go. Uh, this platform railing will collapse uh, for low clearance areas. You can actually pull the pins and they will fold over. Um, if everybody knows that. Uh, kind of a universal. I'll flip this back to drive so everybody um, sure will have a million questions. Does it uh, flip back and forth without a problem? Yes, it does. I'm not hiding anything. That's why I'm taking the time to show this video. Safety emergency switch air works, you can see, running the drive control function, and it doesn't do anything. So, go ahead and get in. Again, this is an older lift, does have forklift pockets, um, does work, has a good charger, new batteries. Uh, charger actually was new whenever I purchased it, it laid around here, uh, but the charger is good, and it charges. Uh, I have nothing to hide, this is just a inexpensive used lift. But if you have work to do around your shop or you just need an inexpensive man lift, here it is. Uh, something new like this today is probably eighteen to 20000 easy. So any questions on this, uh, Skyjack SJ6832, uh, electric uh, man lift, please let us know. Uh, if you need a shipping quote, we'll be glad to get you on. You know, keep in mind if you have a forklift to unload or loading dock, uh, this thing probably weighs somewhere around the 5,000 pound mark. I will have that in the description. So if you again have any questions, 814-658-3066. Please check out our website, www.marksupplyco.com. See us on Tractor House, Machinery Trader, and on eBay at Mark Supply 88. Thank you very much for viewing Mark Supply Company, and as always, have a great day.